Ross County's meeting with Kilmarnock marked the club's 40th top flight match in Dingwall. Two defeats to open the season. Not the most impressive start for Ross County. Here's Quinn though. He's done well to knock that ball onto Arkan who unleashes. Took a touch on its way through. Johan Arkan shot. Well, Rocco Quinn did so well to keep the ball alive. This is Kiri. On it's come back off the chest of Samson. But he was alert enough to go and gather before Philip Kish could knock that one in. Slater, scorer of a free kick at Dundee on the opening day. This is Connolly. Oh, he's done well. Connolly to Ngu. And so nearly a debut goal for Michael Ngu. Former Liverpool striker. Slater towards the back post. It's Connolly. And Reguero flew across his goal to make the save. The former Kilmarnock player playing against his ex teammates. Kilmarnock will come again. Lofted towards the back post. McGuinness. Oh, it's gone in. Reguero misjudged the flight. And Josh McGuinness has his first goal for Kilmarnock. Chris Chandler with the cross. McGuinness's header. Reguero just seemed to go with the wrong hand. And a goal for Alan Johnson's side just before half time. One back by Barber. And now this is McKenzie. And Goo with the layoff. Barber again, who combines well with Rory McKenzie. McGuinness, well, he was being held off by Scott Boyd. Had a hold of his shirt. Again, he's fired wide. There's two wins in their last 11 away games for Kilmarnock. They've lost seven. Struggled on the road last season. McKenzie for Barber. Well marked by Carey. This is Slater, lofted in, and a free header for Obedai. And he too has his first goal for the club. Completely free, he could barely miss. Topi Obedai makes it 2-0 to Kilmarnock. Their fans who have made that long trip up the road to Dingwall are delighted. Richard Britton to the back post. And Melvin DeLeu couldn't steer his header on target. Well, normally when he starts a game, he's one of Ross County's better bets for a goal. Barber, one back by Quinn. That's a loose pass. Slater with the intercept. Obedai now to Michael Ngu. It's Ngu in, and there's Robbie Muirhead. Substitute Just flashes his header wide of the target. And Goo providing the opportunity. And there's still time for Ross County, but at this rate, it's going to be three defeats on the bounce to start the season unless Jake Jervis can do anything about it. Cardle now. Good cross, and Boyce has one back. There is still time. For Ross County, Liam Boyce, the former Cliftonville striker, guiding that one in. It's a really good goal from Ross County's point of view. And do they have a sniff of a point? Quinn couldn't find Boyce. Instead, it's Balk who has some work to do. Oh, there's Ngu, he got there before the goalkeeper. Balk was short with the back pass. That allowed Ngu in. Aguero was alert. It's McKenzie. Ngu will have to do the chasing. But it is full time. And it is a victory for Kilmarnock. Ross County, three successive defeats to start the season. Subscribe now for free.
and catch all the action on SPFL YouTube.